soldier may find food for himself on the march, but what of a new sword, a bandage, or sandals? Welcome back, everybody. Um, I did end the previous turn. Uh, champion. Um, nothing really happened. Uh, I recruited two, two ponies. That's about it. I am letting my, my son spearhead my, uh, my new campaign. Boom, 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 boom. Commander! There we go. Let's see. He doesn't need that many units. We hunger for battle. But I can reach we Larissa here. None will escape. Oh my god, look at that. <laughs> Fucking 97% of my force survived. Let's see if I can't improve those odds to 100. I like how it, it shows them holding the axe like they're going to be throwing axes. But they actually just throw javelins. But they wield an axe as like a, a backup weapon. Uh, let's not fight in the rain. Alright, fine, we'll fight in the rain. There's no real downside to it. I just... Visually, it, it's like way too cinematic for what's about to happen. I want to fight on flat ground. Here we go. I'm going to do a bit of a different formation this time. Orders understood. Fight to the ready. Form Falata. By your command. Hoplites. Orders understood. I'm going to have these guys out front. Right, he has significantly less range. So let's let's get him out of there. Spread him out. Get running! Let him open fire. I, I don't think that mob is going to reach us. Especially not if I do this. Now they've got quick reload on, and they're just going to start ripping people apart. Oh my god, yeah, that mob is fucked. The militia hoplites might last a bit longer. I'm focusing some of my guys on his slingers. That way, uh, I can worry less about my own. There we go. Oh, here comes men. Pikes ready. Orders. Pretty soon I'm going to have to give the, the drawback command. Oh my god, he is not doing so well. Oh. Yeah, really not doing so hot. Rip them apart. Rip them apart before they reach you. Oh my god, that was close. Hold on, continue. I'm going to show you guys what happens when they get hit in the back. 
Look at, look at how much more quickly they fall now that their their shields are not protecting them. All right, doesn't matter how good your armor is. All right, hitting somebody in the back is going to do some goddamn damage. Even my Spartans get ripped apart when they're hit in the back. I think I did better than 97%. <laughs> I only lost 17 people. And they, they were in uh, this unit here, I believe. Um, I'm pretty sure these two were already wounded from before. Oh, fucking brutal with the copus here. Give me that town. And the Rissa, yeah, they, they, whoever survived that fight is still, uh, still able. Ooh. Better hosses. Well, you know, I do like me some hosses. I should have tried to make you a client state. Shit. Oh well. Maybe they're gonna get attritioned, so their hope is either attacking there or attacking Sparta. And if they attack Sparta, they're really gonna get. Uh, they're gonna get what's for. Because <laughs> I've got a pretty powerful garrison there, in, there at home. I do like that I have this. This is really nice. I don't need this though. I don't think. What I need to do. Oh, this is no. This is what I don't need. I need to turn this into this when I get the chance. Alright, once I hit here, I'm going to make another farm. Uh, ooh, he has a skill. Boop. At your service. Um, I'm going to send you off this way. Because I'm technically at war with these people, and I think I can... Yeah, I can have you steal food from them, which will be nice. Cause that'll uh, that'll replenish my own food stocks. Eventually, I'm attacking Bella. Eventually, they scatter to the winds. Oh shit! You want me to help? I'm not actually gonna help you, but <laughs> I'll uh, I'll pretend. I'll be there. I'll be around. No, you know what? I will help. I'll send my my horses in. That's that's all the help you get from me. Is I'll I'll send some horses in. Cause you you have them. I mean you've got the numbers here. You've got Hellenic Royal Cavalry. That alone should Our be strong enough to win arrived. this for you. Yeah, Cause he's got Hyperius Lancers. That's not nearly as good. I don't think. I don't think it's as good. Yeah. Yeah. No. You're 47 to 49. It's a close. It's close. They're, they're similar. But see, they're shock cavalry. Meaning that they're great on the attack. Not so good in the fight. See, they do a lot of damage. Um, oh, it, it won't let me hover, like... If you look at their melee defense down there in the corner, they they are they do a lot of damage. They got a great charge. Not so good sticking in the fight. What? Oh, there we go. For a minute there, I couldn't move anything. I'm gonna make these guys their own group. My horses. Diamond formation. And let's speed this up. This is not worth my time. Helping him mop up the enemy. See, so he's got slingers. These guys would hurt a little. But these are the real thing you gotta worry about. Even though there's only 24 of them, their charge is still going to be painful. Our hidden units have been discovered. Surprise, bitch! 
The enemy is attacking our allies. Bam! And he's shooting my horses. The enemy general is dead. Yeah, he's winning. Because he's a spear unit. But I win in the end. I lost more than he did because of that. <laughs> we killed about the same. That's okay. The, the horses will be replenished in like a turn. I need to start taking battle captives. Where'd the other one go? Oh, they just disappeared. There was one right here. They just disappeared. Foul mouthed. Are you becoming foul mouthed? That's that's not good. We hunger for battle. All right. Uh, you're next, bitch. Bing. Plus one to horses. Ready for orders. That's your command. Huh. Ready for battle. All right. I'm gonna land there. I'm gonna take it in one fell swoop. I really shouldn't make this a military wharf. Now that I think about it. Make it this, so I have plenty of food, and this I'll make a military wharf. Now, real quick. My time is better spent feasting and hunting than listening, so be quick with your chattering. Wow, you, you really don't like me, huh? Trade. Do you think us children flattered? Come, my friend. Speak. We are men of words. Well met, friend. Sit, and let your words... Nobody wants to be my friend. You honor me with your worthy presence. I am but a humble servant of Pharaoh, lord of all true men. Nobody wants to be my friend. I give you welcome. Let Zeus and all the gods smile. Nobody wants to trade with me. May Hermes bless us both with. It's because I don't have I am tradable eager to hear goods. Your embassy. They do, but I'm about to kill them. Be welcome. If I can give you a fair answer, you will have it. Jesus. Oh well. I need to take a city that has some tradable goods. Like them. <laughs> but they're my, my little friends. So, uh... Probably that. We hunger for battle. And I've got some That's money now. It's a good so... Night. Yeah, I think I'll go for Navos. <clears throat> if I can take all of that up there. Would you kindly allow trade between our people? The logic is clear. All would benefit, including your tax collectors. See, he wants to be my friend, but I need that port. Just like with Athens, man. Irredeemably... Why are my 
children assholes. Only to his troops, plus five morale. Going ashore. Okay, then. Meanwhile, this guy who had the foul mouth thing is now <laughs> respectful. Okay, then. That's that's a thing. Mm. We need good fighters. Jesus, I can only afford one. But I can get Bowman now. I'll get a Bowman. Cause see, he's gonna go north. still really like me. We still haven't had any more kids? Sucks. You need to get married. You're 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 getting up there in age. I'm gonna I'm gonna marry off my son next turn. First thing I'm doing. Superior wife. Oh, she thinks she's superior. He's a political husband. Well, it's not the greatest thing in the world, but at your service. Right. Oh, nope. Don't, don't yes, sabotage it. Jesus, my money's getting a little low at her. So, uh, the sooner I take this town, the better. They look like they have a decent stack here, too. Skirmish Cavalry. But I kind of want this one, so I can get the Tarantine Cavalry. Well, I'll get both. In the end. Commander. Why am I suddenly untrustworthy? Just because I'm going to war? Alright, he has a lot of militia. A lot of militia hoplites. Some mercenaries, some more light hoplites and whatnot. So, I'm, I'm, this is going to be a, a bit of a tough fight, because he has a lot of hoplites. I'm going to have to rely heavily on, on ranged units to soften him up. And if I don't use my cavalry just right, it's going to suck. Ooh, this is beautiful. Let me get a look at this town. Okay, so the greatest strategy for him would be to hold up in this back corner with his cavalry, like, way over here to just swarm around me. If I'm going to attack and I want to group him up, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come through here. Because this is, this is too open. The, the more condensed his men are, the more... My, my slingers have a chance of not missing, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck a pack everybody over here. Alright. 
trust we have an easy fight today, men. But we know that the gods also love their little jokes. So make ready. Keep your wits about you and your swords to hand. Get running! I'm just speeding my men in. Is ready. And then these guys are gonna get ready in case he lands over here. Carry on, toy spears! Yes, come on. I'm going to prepare on this side with my my king unit facing out that way. Cause see, he clearly thought I was going to come that direction. But I'm I'm focusing my attempts on on this pike unit, which is one of his generals. And then after I take this pike unit, then I can restructure to take on this massive chunk of them over here. But I've also got to watch for these guys. He's landing right in front of me. <laughs> oh, he's no, he's throwing javelins into the side of my men. That's very clever. That's that's actually really clever. Commander, as you command. Advance at speed. Because I don't have armor well done on the sides of my men. But I'm, I'm about to take these boats right the fuck out. See, they're they're already fleeing. Why are you all aiming in the middle? There's there's more than just the middle. That's it. Use the hot use the hot rocks. Or the the fiery javelins. And you ladies. Stop, stop shooting. are done, I will admit, you, you cost me a good bit of my ranged ability. I will admit to that. You, uh, you cost me a, a rather large deal of my ranged ability. So I need to push up. And the double. We hunger the blood and battle. Warriors, move out. Because he's locked down in, in shield walls and shit. Pike wall. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, no, go for it. See how well that goes for you. When I start raining hell rocks on you. Missile infantry at your command. You guys hold back. There, now I can see across the battlefield. Ready for battle! Fire it well. They should have a clear shot. No, you, you guys, you guys don't. Okay, well, hold on, hold, hold the fuck on. 
don't. Don't charge just yet. Double time. Oh come on! Please reach your destination before they they do. Got the pikes down just in time. Oh, thank fucking god. That could have been really bad. So now the enemy has to wade into my pikes to reach any of my men. And that, that does not bode well for them. I mean, some of them reach, as you can see. Some of them... Some of them can reach. Because they're spearmen, they have a they have a longer engage distance than swordsmen do. But I, I fully trust my pericoy pikes to be able to handle this shit. Missile infantry. That I'm I'm not even gonna send these guys that way. I'm I'm gonna actually put these guys. Over here. So the real question is how to deal with all this. How to, how to deal with all this. Well, after I'm done whittling away at a chunk of his army on this side, I'll figure that out. I just gotta make... Oh, see, they're under friendly fire, and that's never good. You know, a few of those rocks are going a little low and hitting them in the back. That's why I like archers more. Archers, you never have to worry about that. But archers are difficult to get when you're Hellenic. They're they're a lot easier to get when you're a barbarian or when you're Eastern. But with the Hellenics, it's it's mostly slingers. Which slingers have crazy range, and they're great against lightly armored units like other ranged units. They're essentially an anti-ranged unit unit. You know, or an anti-ranged unit ranged unit. Ugh. That's a Get fucking running! tongue twister. Alright, I'll pull them out because I don't need them over there anymore. These guys aren't, aren't broken for good, but they're broken enough. The enemy's morale is going to finish this for me. Because, like, these guys have barely lost anybody. These guys Carry lost so many fight, because fight. they were under friendly fire. So you see these guys in the back are all bloody because they're getting hit. Well, yep, they're starting to reform and they're headed over here. So I've got to start waging the war on this front. Spartans! Um, Spirit let's just get the hoplites for now. Let's, let's send them over. Let's put the skirmishers behind them. And we'll put the Agriarian Axemen over here. Because what's going to happen is when these lights collide, I'm going to squeeze them through this gap, have them set up here, and let them fire into the backs of anyone who comes to collide with me. And we're going to... Oh, didn't mean to turn that on. We're going to send the melee cavalry all the way to the other side. Because they're going to swoop in on this side and take out all these ranged units and possibly their own cavalry. Oh, he brought his Tarantine over here. They're, uh, they're doing some damage. Holy shit. I'll, uh, I'll have to give it to him there. They're doing some serious damage. Alright, so now I know Tarantines are a pretty good thing to go for. Sparta! Wait for it. And lock it down. Oh my god. His own men are just getting ripped apart by slinger fire. There we go. Now they get torn apart even faster. 
just increased my fire rate. I don't think it increases accuracy. I think it just... Yep, it just increases fire rate. Oh. He's putting the horse... Okay, fun fact about horses. They are inherently weak to missile fire. Because usually the horse is not armored. Um... They, yeah, let's see. There, there goes five of them. Um... That's, that's why horses need to be moving. You can't just have them sit here like this. They're gonna get ripped apart. Oh! He's, he's, it, it's the, the attack of the enemy too. Electric Boogaloo. Uh, they're not doing so hot. They, uh, they got hit pretty fucking hard. Gonna do some risky business to to try and help them out. Oh, this is gonna be great. Oh, horses do not last long against a pike wall. One of our units has used all its ammunition. They, they if he'd charged the pike wall at full speed, you would have just seen horses get deleted. See, look, they're just going down, man. Horses, horses and, and big-ass spears don't mix. Oh my god, look at his javelin men getting fucked up. I gotta admit, though, the, the javelin men, to be able to throw a spear accurately over this fucking distance, you gotta have a hell of an arm. Let's push forward. We hunger for blood and battle. All right, his javelin man came to fight me. That was a bad idea on his part. But you know what? He's uh, he's allowed to make one of our mistakes. units has used all its ammunition. All right. Yeah. Nope. Double time. There we yes, go. Melee cavalry. Go for it. Advance at speed. See these these guys are now all on their fucking own, and they're they're about to get owned. How's it going down here? Really well. Surprisingly. Um, I'm gonna send these guys to hell. Just, just to clean up. You guys, right here. Where are you going? Oh, they're going to attack my agrarians. All right. Well, you're gonna get hit in the back. Fuck out of there! You, you are not melee units. Even though you're you're wielding axes, you're you're not a melee unit. Get, get out of there! All right, set up here and just unload javelins into those guys' backs. Swift riders at your command. Quickly now. Keep the horses moving. Boom. Attack their position. Don't let the javelin men get set up. Because javelins really hurt horses. So I've, I've got a bounce now between these three targets. So that the javelin men can't actually fire at me. And usually in doing so, you break them. It's because the, the constant running horses keep knocking people over, doing damage, helping to break the enemy. He's got a couple men left there. 
There we are. I see these guys showed up just in time. All right, million dollar question. Where's the enemy boss? Spartans, I bet ready. you I have a million dollar answer. Right there. Yup. I'll send the levies in first. Alright, my little Illyrians. Levies take up arms reluctantly, but they fight for their homes and loved ones. You know, I didn't ask how, uh... How enthused they were about fighting. I only ask that they fight. Honestly, they're at a pretty sharp disadvantage. Uh, they do half as much damage. Um, they've got half the... Uh, well, a little over half the melee defense. About half as much armor and... Just a little bit less health. But far less morale, so... You know. Disadvantaged. Definitely at a disadvantage. Yeah. But they're willing to fight. And that's the important part. I feel like these guys would have got here faster if they weren't in a hoplite wall. Oh my god, I only lost 200 people, but I killed over 2,000. <laughs> He deployed almost 3,000, and he only managed to take out around 200 of my men. <laughs> That's ridiculous! Look at these numbers! Look at these fucking numbers! Cheek! Oh my god! Oh my god, gimme. Oh, just stopped him short. Oh, I know you wanted to be my friend, but I am not in the mood for friends right now. Ooh, that's gonna be beautiful, but it's gonna cost three thousand dollars. God fuck damn it. <laughs> that's a lot of money. Uh but I seem to have a lot of money in my pocket right now. I don't know how or why or when I got that much. But I'm gonna put it to good use. Are you ready to serve? No, I don't need any more bowmen. I need actual soldiers. I, I need me some Spartans. Um, because uh, I've only got one. <laughs> so I need two more. Easily. I'll have my three pikes, and then I'll start recruiting some Pericoi hoplites. So I know yesterday I touched on what the Pericoi are, but I don't think I've told you about the helots. Um... So, the helots are, with, you know, a, at the end of the day, um, Sparta being a military state, they had a lot of, uh, well, slaves. From people they'd conquer, to just the poor, who had no other choice. Um, so Sparta had a lot of these slaves, right? They called them helots. And the helots would do a lot of the physical labor around the the home because even Spartan women, as said by the Gorgo skirmishers, uh, even the women were trained to fight and to be healthy. That way, that their you know their kids would be physically healthy. Hopefully, I am eager to hear your embassy. You still don't want to trade with me. Welcome, friend to be of Pharaoh. You guys really like me, but you still don't want to trade with me. I am honored to greet such an ambassador of... <sighs> Fuck all of you. Um... So, yeah. I think I'm gonna attack... Syracuse. Eventually. But right now, I'm going after Rhodes. Yeah, that's, that's the next stop on this fucking pain train. Um... Oh, shit. Hey, I control this. Um, do I want lower recruitment costs, shipbuilding and shit? Probably. 
because it also reduces construction costs. That'd be really nice. Um, don't really have enough slaves to need that one. Wow, 13 public order from this. Yeah, don't really need that. Thank you. Uh, we're going to go with noble philanthropy. That way, when I want to build my thing, it'll, it'll cost less. <sighs> it's still going to cost quite a bit. Um, so that's what Navos has going on for it. That's a lot of barbarians. I don't like... I, I don't like that that's a lot of barbarians. Um, that's not good for me. Because the, the barbarians may not be the greatest armor-wise. I mean, like, this is a good armor unit because he has 60, but, like, you know... They, they've got good shields. That's where most of their armor comes in. They've got great shields. I'm going to check again on Pulpadeva. Oh. I think you guys are fighting. Um, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have her steal food. Go ahead. Fond of gambling and giving. Oh, God. You two are Ready for nightmare. battle. Alright, uh, giving reduces the tax rate in all provinces. Oh, you bastard. And the other one, fond of gambling. At your command. Reduces the tax. Oh, you guys are not making this easy on me. You guys are really not making this easy on me. Couldn't make it easy on me. I'm sitting here, man. I'm I'm fucking trying, okay? I'm fucking trying. But no. No, just, just. I think it's because I keep recruiting units, and that's really also hurting me. Um. All right, Rhodes has got a lot of units currently stationed there. But they have a mine, and that'll really help with my money. So I'm taking it. I'm just I'm just gonna control all the islands in this fucking bay. I'm gonna take this one next, just because I wanna I wanna control the islands that are that are jutting out here. Um. Next turn, I'm sending you up. I think I think 28 units is plenty, especially because there's. Spartans. And you've got some very powerful ranged units right here. You've got an archer, you've got slingers, you've got three javelin men. You've got plenty of hoplites and pikes. Yeah, you're you're fucking ready to wage war. Probably not the This is probably one of my best put together armies. Powerful ranged units, a good javelin unit, some cheap throwaways to uh that can throw, can fight, horses, weaker uh Random, and then the you know I'm gonna I'm gonna lump him in with these guys because he's very similar in stats, way better than these guys. So I've got three of them, three pikes, and a powerful general who has yet to actually see any combat. I, I don't put him in the fight very often. Actually, I think he saw combat once. Anywho, um, let's check politics. How's it going here? They still like me. You and your wife have not made a kid yet. We need to get on that. Future Sparta depends on it. Oh, they're having trouble. I think it's because I'm stealing their food. Oh, a noble daughter appears before you with a plea. Her mother, a very influential woman, insists on sending her to the Temple of Athena, where she is to become a priestess of weaving. Humbly, she asks us to let her serve on the city's planning council. From what we've heard, she's a great student of the mathematics, and her tutors are indeed very proud of her. Should we intervene? If I say no, her mother will pay me $1,000. If I say yes, I get a very important character. I'm going to say yes. You know, all shall serve Sparta. Enough said.
Alright, um... Fam family duty, that's just with everyone. Ooh, plus seven to the civil research. Fuck yeah. You want, Maybe you'll be a good politician, maybe you'll be thankful enough. Go to the RDA, they really don't like me even though they're my clients. See if you can't convince them to, to be more grateful for all that they've been given. <sighs> get, get, get nice and close. They've, they've got some serious units going on here in Rhodes. I'm probably at a heavy, probably at a heavy disadvantage. Ooh, probably at a heavy disadvantage if I go to war with Rhodes. <laughs> Let me see if Rhodes has any friends. Yes, they do. They're military allies with Pergamon, and Pergamon is fucking this entire coast. Alright, uh, Pain Train's gonna have to keep on rolling to, uh... Somewhere else. Mm. I mean, I could go to war with Pergamon. I fucking could. I could also go over here and go to war with... With, uh... Rome. Just, just get them out of the way really early. How long will that take? That's gonna take a few turns. But yeah, I'll do that. I'll send him over there. You, on the other hand... Get your ass up there. See, Navas has this big stack of dudes, but they're all... They're all just levies. <laughs> they're, they're mostly a threat to, um, to my horses. And these guys... I mean, look at that melee defense, though. 57 melee defense. If I look at my guys... I mean, I'm at 78, so I've got some decent, but, like... Still, that puts them almost on par. Just a melee defense. That puts them over my pericoy hoplites. Way over my levies. Jesus. And that, that's not exactly bueno. Oh, political instability is still a thing. That's not good. Huh. Slave revolt in 30 turns. <laughs> I'm so scared. Alright, well, I'll tell you what then. We will go to this. Even though I'm at 23 food already. I've got to, I've got to flip that. Once I build a, a sufficiently powerful oceanic force, I feel like I can take roads and all of them on. But Until that day! Also, my money's going down very fast. Jake no like... I don't like how that's happening. That is not a thing that I am a favorite of. Oh. Okay. Generous tribute? Who died? Wow, she a good diplomat. She get promoted. And I... Uh, I'm not going to wet her just yet, but I am going to send her out again. Let's go to the same people. Cold and uncharismatic, this woman is difficult to like. Oh, no. Minus 10 to her chance of having babies. But hey, she, uh, she got me that muns, dude. Also, I'm going to need you up north. This this fight's getting a lot more intense than I'd previously anticipated. Cause there's now there's now a, a oh my god look at them Thracian skirmishers use javelins to disrupt he's all skirmishers that's all he is oh my god it's just a billion screaming faces forgive me but I cannot I'm up in the mountains for now. 
We cannot follow this order. Oh, you're fine. I like how he's just hanging out in my turf. It's like, fuck off, dude. Oh, shit, wait, I have enough money. I could do the thing. Boom! Hehe. <laughs> and then, uh... Boom. Actually, no. Don't, don't, well... Okay. Just because, like, then in this turf, I can recruit one more unit. One more army recruit capacity. So. How's Larissa doing? It's it's at two. Once it once it hits four, I'm gonna I'm gonna build a, a fucking something. That is not a lot of money a turn. Which is why I need that lead. Oh, they just fucked off. Bully. Oh, she's been found. Ja baby! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> she got stabbed because she's difficult to like. Oh no. <laughs> but the baby! Yay, I have an heir! Thank fucking god. I want to promote you because you, you slept with me. <laughs> you did your civic duty. You squeeze out a baby. Here's a promotion. Alright. I want to stop the units he sent this way from coming back, but I have no fucking clue where they went. No they they really way. fucked off. Pella's kind of weak, because they just hold this center city. If I take this town, this town, and this town, they won't be able to spread. Like, Pella will kind of be trapped. Oh, those are leaves. I thought that was, like, embers and shit. If I can close Pella in, I can eventually, like, dissolve yeah. my relations with them. Yeah, keep going. Come on. Fat-ass dad of my guy. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna end the turn. Uh, luckily, my money's climbing back up. Slowly, but it is. Ooh! The Selicid and Rhodes, I think, are at war. That's beneficial. Oh, they're going that way? They're probably fighting the... the... Whatever they're called. Um, one of the other parties organized a banquet in your capital, threatening your hedge money. How do you react? I'll attend. I, I need to make sure that they like me. Because if they don't like me, then... You know... We're going to have civil issues. And I'm willing to put the state above my own petty needs. 98%. Now, I'm gonna fight it in the field, and I'm gonna get this at almost 100. Because this is his only ranged unit. I mean, these guys might have a ranged, like, attack, but I don't think they do. This is his, really his only ranged unit. And my archer, and I trust these two to be able to destroy it before it ever reaches me. Oh, we're fighting in the field. You have sallied out to meet me. Alrighty, then. of a glorious victory. I thank the gods for these gifts. Now, the victory awaits our efforts. Hold on. If I'm gonna move them so far up, I need to, uh, I need to send some protection. I trust my horse to be able to easily outmatch his. Yep. In fact, the only thing that's a real threat is these guys. Um, that's because they use the Romfila. Yep. They use that. It's a it's a terrifying ass fucking weapon, dude. It 
It'll it'll split a shield in half. And he's got these guys, but not even his spearmen are a threat to my horse. So. Levies. Should I send the levies out? Yeah, I'll send the levies. Why not? Just to just to kind of help out. You know what? I'm gonna put the citizen cavalry. Uh, I'm gonna put them down here. I'm gonna speed up time, cause again, this shit's barely worth it. This this is just a spanking about to happen. You guys stay in formation. Scoot you forward a little. There we go. And boom. Our hidden units have been discovered. Now I save them. Let this crash. His men are being ripped apart by javelins. Holy shit. They're not even using... I mean, they have a shield, but it's like a tiny little arm shield. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, they don't even see it coming. And you, you're fine. You've only lost a few. The, the horses are saving you. Yeah, I lost a few. I was a little slow on the react. That's my bad. I have no clue how long I've been recording. <laughs> That's probably an hour, so I'm gonna call it there, guys.